has his own little fun house to play in. Be careful, a trick can be just around the corner. Always great when a watermelon donut breaks your fall. While you're here, why not try this new ride? A water slide. It leads right into your own personal little pool. Of course, there's just no place like home. <laughs> Though it's kind of hard to keep track of them now. Where is he? Uh... Waiter, there's a hamster in our salad. <laughs> naughty, naughty. Mm. Jail time? Come on, can't you just let him off with some community service? No bars can hold him. Or maybe they can. Maybe there's a hidden door, like the fun house. Let's hope that's just a secret tunnel. Oh no, the prisoners escaped? What else can we make? First, bring out the cardstock and glue. Roll it up into a cylinder. Add a puff on top. Let's fill up these walls with beads for a splash of color. Now our hamster has his own hills to run over. Well, they're hills from his perspective. Now he's on his way to freedom. Ooh, looks like someone's back in the labyrinth. Oh no, the room's filled with trap doors. Good, it looks like those eyes will keep him from falling. Uh-oh, this looks like a tight squeeze. Not what they usually mean by knock down the door. Oh, this last one's a little tricky. There we go, we're out of here. Always time for a selfie break. But this felt pen is giving us an idea. It's a little mermaid. Don't skimp on the scales. Though I guess she doesn't need a face. I see, it's like one of those carnival attractions. Just hope he doesn't squeeze out beforehand. I wonder what she's got planned for that straw. Let's stand them up on some cardboard. Now let's add some walls. Don't stop at just four. It's another maze. And don't forget the finishing touch. A ball pit. Well, the first level seems simple enough. Nothing like a ball pit to break your fall. Good, he's making it through the straws. Anything in those boxes? Come on, we're almost home free. He made it. Let's sit down for the final course. Quick, before they bring out the check. Does he want to share his stuffing? He has a surprise inside. A pop tube. We can use it to make a new maze. Can't forget the ball pit. Let's roll up this pipe cleaner too. Kind of looks like a pigtail. So far, so good. No pipe cleaner's a match for him. Now this one's kind of tricky. At least there's a backyard. Sort of. Victory! The ball pit and a way out too, I guess. Mm, bananas. Wait, something's off about this one. It's a toy. Open it up. Take out that stuffing. Now 
Now hang it up. It's like a hammock. This room sure is fancy. There's even a flat screen. Welcome to the Banana Cabana. Oh, he needs a lift. Looks like Huggy Wuggy wants to lend a hand or two. Great idea. Make the hammock come to you. Want to take a nap? Nah, I'd rather go exploring, too. Hey, what's that mark on the wall? We should really fix this up. It's time to whip out our 3D pen. Draw a circle for a base. Keep adding on. Now we'll need some sticks, well, sticking out. It's like a tunnel. Let's fill it up with some stuffing. Add some eyes. It's starting to look familiar, isn't it? Climb up, and it's a brand new place to rest. What else is there to explore around here? A new hole. Wherever this leads to, this tunnel looks fun enough already. Wonder what she's up to. Gluing frames together? Oh, look, it's a little house. It needs a paint job. This shouldn't take too long. Ouch, should have known. Those blocks, at it again. Maybe we can make something out of them. It's what they're made for. These blocks add a nice touch. Hmm. What else can we add? <laughs> These sticks are great for building too. Just add hot glue. Now our house has a brand new backyard playground. Can't forget the ball pit. Time for some real fun. It's what playgrounds are for. Look, it's a swing just for him. Who said show jumping was just for horses? It's a slide, just without water this time. Time to explore the house. Can you squeeze through? These blocks are the perfect decor. Real postmodern. Uh -huh. Wow, these disco tunnels must have been on sale. I think we're getting lost. Oh wait, what's that in the distance? It's a trophy, congratulations. After all these rooms and challenges, he certainly earned it. Though now I guess we'll have to make him a trophy room. Unless this is the trophy room. Eh, just accept it. It's the hamster's world. We're just wow. living in it. Squeak, 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 squeak stuff. <laughs> Catch you next time. Wait, Jeeves, mm -hmm. do you see what I see? Mm -hmm. <gasps> There's a dog in a basket. In the water. Oh, we gotta save him. Hmm. And by we, I mean you, Jeeves. <laughs> I'll whip up my very own doggy pocket. I'll call you Seiko. Let's go to your new home. Aw, who's a good girl? Ugh, with bad breath. What you need is this finger toothbrush. Add some toothpaste. And start brushing. Good girl. I accept payment in puppy kisses. Well, aren't we feeling jumpy today? Here, this should calm you down. Now for some relaxing oils. And a nice face roller massage. 
Next up, a gua sha scraper. It'll take care of any muscle pain. And who can say no to a manicure? Plus a nice soothing paw rub. A face mask? I guess it fits. And while you relax, we'll get lunch ready. You know, it helps to chew your food. Looks like you could use a challenge. Like this dog puzzle. We'll need to hide some treats inside. Okay, come on down. You're the next contestant on The Treat is Right. You win a snack. And another. And you take your time enjoying them. Finally, it's okay to play with your food. Wow, sand bottles. Squish them up. And it's like a day at the beach. It's also great for making paw prints. And if you want to make it last, fill it up with tiny treasures. Glitter. And pour on some epoxy resin. Pretty soon, you'll have something sparkly for your dog to wear. Aw, oh, I love you too, but just let me finish my nails. Okay, we need a distraction. A rubber glove. Now fill it up with liquid and seal it up. Make a bunch and place on your pup for some hands-free petting. So we can get back to... Oh no! Looks like someone's been shedding. Don't worry, our lint rollerball will save the day. Works great on sleeves, so let's try the couch. Now everything looks store-bought new. Aw, he's sharing his toys with you. He must like you. Or he's just playing fetch. Extreme edition. We need something to hold them all. Like this inflatable pool. There's plenty of room inside for everyone. Careful, you'll tire yourself out. Or is that the idea? Well, as they say, <laughs> let sleeping dogs lie. It's getting late. Almost time for bed. Which reminds me, he needs a bed. First, let's get him off the floor. Get a laundry basket and some cut-up pool noodles. Lay them inside and add a blanket. And the final touch, a cute puppy. Oh, don't forget the bedtime story. Once upon a time, and they lived happily ever after. Hmm, 40 winks wouldn't be so bad. It's still early, so let's keep quiet. Never mind, but hey, free planks. Always fun to squeeze in a little woodworking. Especially when making a dog house. Uh -huh. 
Seiko's gonna need a nameplate. <laughs> and a potato? Ooh, a potato stamp. Dip it into some paint. And decorate the doghouse. Everybody raise a paw. Next, add some push pins to the sides. Tie some string around them, and you can make letters. D O G. Come on, Seiko. Oh, I think she likes it. Whoops. Yeah, I'd say goodbye to that shoe. You know, if you got any old pumps, grab some pipes. Add them together into a cube. And hang the old shoes on top. You know, Seiko's right. Shoes are fun. Hang some rope on the other side. We're making a puppy playground. Catch the ball, Seiko! Wow! Three for one! Oh, let's hang these up, too! And that's just the start! Come on, Seiko! Let's try it out! Now for the shoes! Ha! Huh, Seiko's gonna sleep good tonight! Oh, it's hot! Oh no! Seiko! You're panting! And dogs can't sweat! Well, mm, paw pads. Jeeves! Oh, a duvet cover? Lie it down on the ground. Now place a fan on its side. And blow it up nice and big. It's the coolest spot around, literally. Time to make some art. Ooh, Seiko wants to help. Hmm, it's not such a bad look. So why don't we make more paw prints? Scan them and hang them up at your house. He'll always know he's home. Yeah, I think Seiko's gonna like it here. But sometimes, all a dog really needs is just a nice new tennis ball. Not that all his new toys aren't cool. Ah, who am I kidding? New stuff's great! <laughs>